Hello, welcome to my easy statistics. In this video, I want to discuss about do we need normality test for ordinal data? For example, see this uh, data where we have customer satisfaction CS1 and CS2, perceived quality PQ1, PQ2, PQ3. In this way, we have all Likert scale variables are they which are ordinal data. Generally, scholars ask that they want to do normality test for this type of ordinal data when we want to do the analysis. Let us discuss, do we need to do normality test for this type of ordinal data or not? If you have a large sample size and you are dealing with ordinal data, it may not be necessary to conduct a normality test. Here's why. Normality tests are typically used to assess whether the data follow a normal distribution, which is a requirement for certain parametric tests. However, for ordinal data, the assumption of normality may not be relevant or necessary. Ordinal data are categorical in nature and often do not follow a normal distribution. With a large sample, generally in social science, we take sample of 300 and above. So with a large sample, the central limitation theorem comes into play. According to the central limit theorem, the sampling distribution of mean tend to approximate a normal distribution regardless of the underlying distribution of the data, provided that the sample size is sufficiently large. This means that even if your ordinal data are not normally distributed, you can still rely on asymptotic normality of the sampling mean to make inferences. In summary, if you have a large sample size and are working with ordinal data, it may not be necessary to conduct a normality test. So we don't need to conduct normality test when the data is ordinal in nature. Only precaution is the data must be large in sample size. Thank you for watching the video. I hope this video will be useful for your research.